Look, 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 look. Uh, this is from Francis, aka the world the biggest the princess. One off. So send a message to the group chat and say, so dot 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 dot. Like Donald Trump style. Are all the barbers closed? Dot 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 dot. I'll be working out of this pandemic a yeti. Really? Pretty sure eBay is open. Bruh. Excuse me, what are you doing in my wardrobe? Hey? Excuse me. What are you doing there? Get down. Mister. Get down. No? Okay, that's that all then. Alright, so the hair is done. Huh? Looking sharp again. Wait. Let's get rid of this. Still new. Alright, so I thought I'd give you a little bit update about the waxing the, for the chain, right? I don't know if you remember Adam and I first time like first time experiencing time. using wax instead of the uh, normal loop. The feedback is good and bad. Because at first it was like, okay, really clean, um, pretty smooth, but then we both have the same problem where after two to three rides, the chain gets noisier, it feels like metal on metal. But I think, I think I figure out why. Have a look at the drivetrain. It's like minimum wax. I also waxed my stinner. It gets a little bit dirty. Um, yeah, so what happened is, hold on. I think I figured out why, because uh, look at this. All right, that's wax. Now, when I first time when I did it, the temperature was too hot. So when I dipped the chain into the, the rice cooker, when I took it out, it's too hot and the, the wax just like, is just like water, just like oil drip all down. So I hang the chain outside and when it cools down, when it fully dried, the chain doesn't feel very stiff. It's supposed to feel pretty hard. That means there's not enough wax to begin with. That's why it doesn't last very long. Now look at this. I turn off the rice cooker, let it dry, let it cool down and look how much wax is on the chain now okay see how much wax on the chain now when i break it down now this more looks like it my tcr is looking good ready to go now i got a phone call from a guy called andrew um he bought a bike off for me today actually so what happened was he lives in Adelaide, I think. He traveled to Darwin and he got stranded there because all the flights are canceled. He has a few bikes at home, but it's just too much hassle for the wife to, to transport a bike to him. Now he's dying to ride, which I'm more than <laughs> happy to help him. So I'm gonna pack a bike and then send it tomorrow. <sighs> Poor Andrew. All right, just a thought. Everything's packed with the integrated C post sticking out or protected. So it's ready to go. And this happened. All right, guys, don't learn from me. I guess Andrew won't be very happy to ride without a front wheel. So damn it.